guys today i'm going to share my get ready with me for this look i wore this in mumbai on my meetup and please don't mind i'm shooting this in the balcony of the room where i was staying so yes i'm going to get my makeup kit out and boom we're going to start off with the innisfree green tea mist i am loving this mist so i'm going to spray it all over my face and i'm going to wait for it to settle into my skin so i'm going to fan with my hands then i'm going to take the inglot under makeup base this is my favorite primer and especially for mumbai humidity i'm just going to rub it between my fingers and then apply it all over my face like so and yes this will help my makeup stay for a longer period of time then i'm going to take wet and wild coverall foundation all the shade names are going to be in the bottom bar so check that so i'm just going to apply this all over my face like this first and then i'm going to take the makeup revolution pro fix makeup fixing spray wow my tongue just tied there i'm going to spritz this on my foundation brush and then i'm going to buff out my foundation to get a more flawless finish and to make my makeup more summer proof humidity proof because this just helps in you know the makeup uh, fixing spray wow this makeup fixing spray thing is a tongue twister makeup fixing spray helps in uh, your makeup to last longer so i'm using the, that to apply my foundation i you can do the math guys i don't need to tell you each and everything right so yes i'm just buffing my foundation in here so that it's all nice and seamless and of course you have to cover your neck because if you don't then it's going to stand out and it's going to look weird and i'm going to do my under eyes everything although i am going to use a concealer next but just you know covering everything and all of this has been done without a mirror so please don't mind So yes, I'm just buffing, buffing, and buffing, and buffing. Yep. Then I'm going to take Revlon Color Stay Concealer and I'm going to apply it under my eyes in a sort of a triangular form. You see that triangular shape that's getting built. So yes, I'm going to apply it there, and then I'm going to apply it on uh, the bridge of my nose, under my, uh, between my eyebrows, on my forehead. Cupid's bow, chin, regular places which I like to do, and then I'm taking the same foundation brush and I am blending all of that concealer out. I love, love, love this concealer. It stayed on my skin for all day long. That was due to the fixing spray and primer and everything, but still, it did stay on my skin for all day long, and it did cover all my dark circles and darkness going around. It highlighted my skin, as you can see. Yes. In short, I love this concealer. Next, I'm taking Vivo Mattifying Loose Powder. You know it, guys. I love this. It just makes my skin feel look more airbrushed and all of those nice things. Plus, it mattifies it to the dot. So yes, I'm just taking this Kabuki brush and. buffing this all over then i'm going to take makeup revolution ultra bronze bronzer and i'm going to contour slightly so i'm just going to go on the hollow of my cheekbones right there i'm going to do the other cheek off camera like i just edited it out so yes i'm going there and then i'm going to go on my jawline because i knew i had a lot of photos to get clicked and i didn't want that double chin to show <laughs> and then i'm going to contour my forehead contour my forehead Then I'm going to take this Wet and Wild Mega Glow powder and I'm taking the middle two shades and using them as my blush. Whenever I travel, I make sure I travel with a uh, multi-purpose thing. So this also doubled up as my highlighter. I used that lightest shade right there and I took a fan brush and I highlighted with it. This just makes sure there is less baggage space that is, you know, covered up. So yes, I highlighted my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, between my eyebrows, forehead, Cupid's bow, chin, regular areas. You know the drill. Then I'm going to take Tony Molly 7 Day Eyebrow Tattoo Pen and at this point of time I realized I can't do this without a mirror. So I just grabbed a small mirror and I did my eyebrows like I normally do. I start with a line bit underneath my eyebrows and then i use my finger to push the color up to make it look more natural you can do this with powders with eyebrow pen i am not really sure about gels and all but you can definitely do this with powder just draw a line on the bottom part of your eyebrow like this and then just push it up this also make sure your eyebrow ends up more neatly then i'm going to take maybelline baby lips in tropical punch and i am just no this is berry sherbet and i'm just going to apply this all over my lips 
Then I'm going to take Sleek Rio Rio Limited Edition Palette and the first shade I'm picking up is this one. All the names would be in the bottom bar and I'm going to apply this all over my lids. This is a really gorgeous color so I'm just packing it on my lids. Then from the same palette I'm picking this wine purplish shade and I am applying this to the crease and then blending it out perfectly. This just adds a really nice pop of color and but not being too over the top. I'm going to add more color by taking the sleek Arabian Nights Smoke and Shadow palette and picking up that green shade right there because it matches my top perfectly and I'm going to apply it to my lower lash line and then smudge it out perfectly. Then I'm going to take Maybelline Colossal Liner and then I'm normally going to line my eyes because I have so much color going on to my eyes. I don't want to add a wing to take away from the color. So I'm just normally lining my eyes. Then I'm going to take Color Essence HD Volume Mascara. This is the bomb.com and I'm just going to apply it to my upper and lower lash lashes, not lash line, lashes both. This is, a su this is such a creamy mascara plus it's waterproof so it's perfect for humid areas like Mumbai. Then I'm just kiss kissing away my lip balm so there's no excess of it. And then I'm going to take my favorite MAC Cross Wires. This is such a beautiful peachy pink lipstick. And then I'm just applying this all over my lips. This stays on for all day long. Then I'm going to open my hair and it was already straightened. So I'm just going to comb it out using my Vega Detangling Brush to make sure there are no knots in my hair. And yes, I'm in the balcony, so there was wind all over as well. Then I'm going to take my John Frieda Frizz Ease Cream, Frizz Ease Cream because it was really humid and my hair was turning into a frizz ball. So I just like ran through with, ran through the cream through my fingers. Hope that made sense. And then I'm again going to take the Makeup Revolution Makeup Pro Fix and spritz it all over my face. And then my favorite Imari Seduction goes on to my pulse points. So yes, this is actually my outfit. It's a crop top with music symbol on and jeans and sneakers. If you guys like this video, I will see you guys on Monday. Till then, take care. Bye.